We're missing something. Oh! What? How did we miss that? Hello all! We are recording some more Spirit Fair today. Yay! Aha! <laughs> Alright, yeah, anyway, yeah, off we go now for more Spirit Fairer time. Woohoo! Ah, feels good. I think we're coming to a close. Yeah. Now we've got the ability to do burst light. Q, that's right. Yeah, Q. Perfect. Oh, oh there we go. Yeah, we're live. Perfect. Yep. Alright. Uh, let me just do a little chat thing that says, Hello! I forgot about doing that as well. It's gonna pop up on the screen. 91%! Nice! There we go. Yeah. Woo oh, yep. It's gone. Keep going. Yes, we now have light bursting things. So... Ah, oh, damn it! Keyboard's still... still on the shit. Oh! Yeah! Oh my god! It is a lighthouse. Is this a lighthouse? Let's go there. Hmm. I'm not sure about it. And also, yeah, quest is... Alright, yeah, those. Alright, so... It... Damn, that doesn't count as a lighthouse. <laughs> Alright, yeah, Oxford, improve the stations, alright, and that means... What? When did we get XP bottles? When the hell did we get XP bottles? Might make you gain a level. Who knows? <laughs> Might? Alright, interesting. Oh damn. Oh no. It's gonna be a storm rain. Super stormy rain that we have to reach all the way to Atolls. Good job, cow. Get to Atolls first! Oh! Wait, what? Oh. No. It's okay. Oh, it was just right there. Guess it's not Atolls thing anymore, as <clears throat> it was like a supreme version of it. Yep. Uh, Alright. Anyway, yeah, we're gonna be doing our usual thing, which is a uh, cheering, milking, checking all the other stuff. Guess feeding Buck? Buck's the only one we feed. As no one else is on the boat. No one else is on the boat. So sad. Everyone's gone. Everyone's all vanished. Buck! Yes! You need the food! Oh. Oh, no you don't. No hug as well. Okay. Interesting. Though, so, I guess he was telling me that he's got sustenance to give? Uh-huh. <laughs> Alright, what's this? We've got chests to find. Oh, what? <laughs> nice. Whee! Whee! Damn, itchy face. Whee! Ooh. No! Come back! Wind, come back! Whee! Nice. Alright, what are we missing? We're missing something- oh! What? How did we miss that? That's it! That's all we needed. Alright, don't know what I can do with that. Leave me alone. Nope. Timing was wrong with that. No. 
Anyway, well, guess that's over. Oh, crap. Well, why is that outline the blue? Why is it blue? Also, I guess... Nice. Nice. Phone vibrated? The other phone. The camera phone. <sighs> now this will take a while. Oh, my back doesn't feel good. Damn, how the hell did I miss that before? So strange. Alright. Nice. Now what is the point of this? What was the point? What was the reason? Ah! A a boat. Huh. Damn. Such a strange place. Ah, oh, hey Lily. Hey Lily. Oh, give Lily a hug. It is Lily, right? Also, I guess we can also do a whole big old Oh wait, uh What's this stuff? Alright, yeah, cool, perfect. Lighthouse nearby. Hey. Let's go! Also, lore dumping time. Time to check on the files. Because that was something we unlocked the last time. Files! Gwen. Almost lost a finger while living in a farm in Indiana. Her favorite cigarette brand has always been Red Apple. The night her mother died, she ate five buckets of popcorn to deal with grief. Aww. Astrid makes a mean guacamole, but hates eating it. <laughs> Despite her vocal protestation, she loves hearing Giovanni snoring. Slapped a Nazi soldier with a cast iron skillet during the war. Nice. <laughs> Gustav doesn't understand the deal with Chablis, really likes rugby, thinks the paradigm shift of post postmodernist movements was a mistake. Elena might have eyes on the, in the back of her head. Hates when people drag their feet. Saw the potential in you all along. Oh. Uh, Alice likes one granddaughter more than the rest, but will never tell. Sometimes dreams, dreams of Ansgar's strong arm. Ansk. Oh, oh, that's right. The uh, like romance novels and stuff like that. Atul caught the fish with his bare hands. Awarded a participation award. Uh, at a wood carving contest, sits down in the shower. Ooh, interesting. Summer thinks citron and quartz are different stones. Are they not? <laughs> Once mimic the movement of sunflower fields for a whole day, secretly thinks Rose's family is weird. <laughs> Jackie likes to boast about his foreign origins. Hmm, crap, kind of like me. But now I'm more on the opposite. I like to boast of my Filipino origins. Woohoo! Ah, uh, yeah. But doesn't know much about his father's country. Ooh, interesting. Okay, not like me. I know quite a lot. <laughs> Often in his underwear because he runs hot. Has musky memories... Murky. Goddamn, not musky. Has murky memories of his childhood. Ah, oh, they can't sleep. Bruce and Mickey. Thinks you don't... Need to know right now. Loves marble on everything. Alright, yeah. Says Mickey has never lost a fight. Beverly. Won second place at Chelsea's annual chili cook-off. Never forgets if someone has ever been mean to her. Only had one favorite neighbor in her life. Buck. Secretly thinks Demons and Ghouls second edition is better than the first. Has a fondness of Paul Bunyan. Paul Bunyan. Damn, there was a song about that in uh, Phineas and Ferb. I don't even remember anymore. What the hell was it? Paul Bunyan. Something. Oh! Oh, really? Nom um, nom. What was that about? <laughs> what the hell happened there? Crap, I completely missed the notifications! Oh my god. Well, hello, uh, my tiny pumpkin. Didn't notice you there. Uh, but yeah, okay, yeah. Uh, Daria has chromesthesia, a sound to color. Synesthesia. Synesthesia. Was extremely popular throughout her art academy. Wishes she wouldn't act 
up as much when she got when she gets visitors. Giovanni splashes himself with other people's perfumes whenever he can. Had once stolen an ashtray that already belonged to him. What? Knows almost all of Pablo Neruda's poems by heart. Stanley saw a squirrel once. Ate two breakfasts in a day one time. Uh, likes looking up at the stars at night. Oh, nice. Lily never turns down a drink afraid of the big unknown. Oh, damn, that's all. I thought it was gonna be like a lot more for some reason. Huh. Nice. Anyway, off to go here for, to a lighthouse. First lighthouse. Oh, nice. I do love me some water. I'm a person who loves water. Is that it? Yeah, we're over. Wee! Do 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 do. Climbing up the ladder. A. Hey. Ooh, Ooh, that bird. Wee! There's a bird up there. Is that bird real? Damn it! Can I somehow make it up there to see that bird? Oh. Ah, Aspirate. Oh, we can see the constellations. Okay, we aren't making it. Da. Damn. Who was this? Alright, nothing. Nice. Anyway, we've unlocked the first thing. And now I think this, like fully unlocks more of the map or something? I don't really remember what the point of these lighthouses were. Opals. What can I sell you? Alright, nothing. Whee! Nice. <coughs> okay, cool. Ooh, Buck has something to do. Talk to Buck. Nice. Alright, Sandwich Walk. Which one is closer? Also? Oh, really? That it? Huh. Alright, Sandwich Walk is over there. Nord's... Ah. Yeah, Nord, Nord Spears... The, the thing. <laughs> Danish words. Wonderful. You did it, Commander. The first fire has been lit, and you can hear the hopeful chant of the free people from afar. Your worth is grander! Then the mightiest arm of Croxador, the paladin, the moon birds of Wa Erin, uh, will soon sing your praises in all the languages of Romalda. But Commander, as bright our moment of joy can shine, we have to remain vigilant. Gomgota and his lackeys will probably be alerted by the sight of this glorious fire and <gasps> lurking in the branches. Roll initiative. Fifteen. Hey, nice. Great. Amidst the scholar of the exotic foliage, you can clearly decipher a group of orcs and goblins progressing towards your encampment. Greeting, getting closer, springing from their retreat, they jump on you. Fight! Hey! Nice. Oh, down here. Hey, nice try. Okay, so this is how we get XP bottles. Okay. See, I like this. Like, it's a stage play. And we got the the spotlight on us. Ah! Hey, nice. Yeah! Take that! Wee! Oh, nice. Yahoo! Woohoo! Oh! No, didn't mean to accidentally do caps lock. Oh, crap. Oh, oh yes! Wee! Yahoo! Words of Yahoo and Yehees! Hey. That's like all I can say. Oh, take that. Foul orc or goblin. Goblin! Oh shit! Ooh. Oh no! Damn it, I could have done double. The hell? Look, I think that's all. Hey, nice. Ooh, you are hungry. Have a green salad. Nice. 
Did we find out stuff you, you like old fashioned? That's right. Have a hug. <laughs> nice. Hello. Also, it seems. Oh! oh victory! The dust from what was an epic battle barely settles. Layers upon layers of evil carcasses litter the ground of the battlefield. You are exhausted, but once again victorious. Make a perception check. 14. Success. Hey, nice. As you observe your defeated enemies, you can only wonder where Gongata lies. He is nowhere to be seen. His pathetic retreat doesn't surprise you. He is a follower of Gore Nimloth, after all, and his cowardice is notable. Quick, let's ride past... Post haste. The next fire awaits. Onward. Nice. Hey, Jackie. Hey, yeah, you just sleeping there? Also, yeah, um. We still don't have that. God damn it. What the hell? So, improving. What do we need for a field? Oh! Hey, nice. We got everything. Woohoo! Nice. Did it. Wake up, Jackie. Wake. Awaken. Oh. Okay, yeah, yeah, I can. Oh shit! It replaces. It replaces a thing. More sunflowers, though. Crap! That I didn't know. No, I didn't. You sound so much like Atoll. Nice. No. There you go. What a beaut! As always, sellers, great work. Such great work, actually, that the bees have already started living in their hive. Now remember, bees eat flowers. But at least they did at Gramps' place. Maybe they eat uh, some other stuff. Falafel, honey? <laughs> Yeah, better not mess with the proud art of honey making. Anyway, there's a trick to keeping your bees happy. If you want them to give you honey, make sure to keep some mature plants around the hive. Okay, alright. When the hive is nice and plump, the honey with honey, you uh, uh, just get in there real good. And then you just swipe that sweet sticky bounty super quick like. Got it! If you have any questions, just ask. Oh! That makes me think of something else. You know me, I don't need much. I could pretty much sleep anywhere, but I've been thinking, nice, you can need a house. Yay! You know, as your assistant, living in the living in the same common area as the patients. Well, it's a bad look, ain't it? I only think you should build some kind of staff room. Nothing fancy, just somewhere to lay down after a shift. Four balls and a roof. I'm not a guest here, after all. Anyway, just a thought. I hope you can get it. See ya. Hey, nice. Jackie on call room. Oh wait, crap, did you want food? No, oh, damn, you do. Fried food. You like things fried. Have a stimulant. Alright, I didn't give you a stimulant. I didn't give you a fried food. <laughs> nice, okay. Whee! Hello, my name is Jackie. New quest. Uh -huh. And finally, woohoo! Pine planks and cotton fabric. Okay. We got cotton. Oh, there we go, cotton thread. But we need more. Let's just do all with this. Nice. Ooh, damn, that is tiny. Hmm. Nice. No. Damn it. Nice. Woohoo! No. No. Hey. No. <laughs> okay. Now we got cotton thread. Time to make a bunch of fabrics. And they're smaller and slightly faster. Damn it. Hmm. Oh, damn. Nah, I don't think that's enough. Let's do some more. Woohoo! Ooh, nice. Aw. Oh. Yay. 
And we also need pine. That's what it said, right? Do we have pine? Nice, we got a lot of pine. Woohoo! Oh, this is the goddamn jig jag. Zigzags. Jig jag? Jig jag. Zigzag logs. Oh, damn. <laughs> nice. Perfect. <sighs> okay, that's good. Nice. Woohoo. I've been a bit of I've been a bit on a game buying spree. I have bought what do you call it? Um uh, no it's not improve. Couple more Assassin's Creed games to my collection that I already have of many Assassin's Creed games. I got more though, as I'd like to maybe attempt to have all or play all the Assassin's Creed games, but there are some that I love to replay again. The ones I just recently bought were the Chronicle ones and the... Oh, oh, interesting. The Chronicle ones and the Syndicate, because they're on Steam deals! Woohoo! Nice. Oh yeah. Obviously great for deals. Eh, we actually did it! And it's, um... <laughs> very... Well, yeah, it's pretty much exactly what I asked for, right? I guess I just didn't expect it to be so... drab? Not that I mind, you should see some of the places I've lived. In comparison, this looks like a five-star hotel, but like, more boring. But in a good way. Boring like meditation or reading. Zen? Is that a word? Anyway, thanks a bunch. I'll be able to assist you much better with this little on-call room. A hey, nice. Awesome. And woohoo, get them eggs. Hell yeah. Egg collecting time. And now that we're here, let us light up this flame. Oh god, my arms. And make our way to the next after lighting up the flame. Oh, hello. Well, well. Who did you end up picking? What? That's wonderful. Kathleen really good addition in the cast. Okay, yeah, this is about the movie person. Superb last minute casting director. Regular should uh, go on her honeymoon more often. All right, well, sorry to this sound. Big move fast. Okay, this is just words. Y'all can read. Y'all can pause and read if this is the recording version. But uh, yeah, everyone's booked up. All right, yeah. Woo words. Yep, yep. Okay. <clears throat> I'm here for the other thing, but uh. Oh, nice. Oh, yay. Why is this area so tilted? What the hell? Why did I reach here before? Okay, anyway. Wooyah! Take that! May the beacon be lit! That place pisses me off. <laughs> what place? Jackie's place? Or, or this place? This place? What's the point of this rope? It's a weird looking rope. Why are these places locked? It feels so strange. No! Anyway, woohoo! Nice. <laughs> Alright, yeah, uh, after doing that... Let's now... Alright, yeah, I thought they would do like a big blast that would reveal more of the area. I guess it just doesn't. Next, we head off to Sandwich Walk. Sandwich Walk! Aha. Uh -huh. Time for some more XP gaining. The second fire of Tondor is lit. Clamors of exult exultation spreads throughout the vast expanses of the kingdom. The Chosen One has arrived! She who bears the light will help us all! Glory to the Commander! Glory to Holar! 
your heart lifted by such grandiose acclamation, your soul irradiates with serenity. But your mind remains watchful and perceptive. You know that, steered by an over the upheaval that marks their near demise, the orcs of the shadow damn my nose is like very irritating today. Shadow Seal Clan Oh bastard, it's like a little tingle. Uh so Shadow Steel Clan must be closing on your position, and, lo and behold, roll initiative 20, <gasps> critical! Without a moment of hesitation, you jump into the fray, taken by surprise, the approxing... What have we hit? The, pro the approaching phalanx of orc fighters, you ready yourself to mow through them with def deafness and style. Fight! Woohoo! Yeah! Oh, nice. Nice. Oh, crap. Oh, bastard. Oh, my God. Yes, thank you. Come on, get ready. We. Hey. Oh, damn, tiny person all the way over there. Yay. Oh, damn, I could only reach one. <laughs> nice. Oh, you bastard. Nice try. Oh, that's it. All right. <sighs> there you go. Also, did we hit a thing? We hit a snake. Oh, no, we hit turtle. Hello, turtle. What's this? Nice. Aluminum. Alright. Damn. Timing's all wrong. Aluminum, marble. Aluminum, marble, and what tree? Oh, nice. Let's do that again. Uh, aluminum. Yay. Marble. Yay. And crap, I didn't see what tree it was. Oh shit. Uh, I think it was maple. Yep. Hello, little turtle lady. Yep, yeah, I'm done. Now piss off. Vanish. You stopped my goddamn ride. What a fight. They didn't stand a chance! What remains of their shattered dark armors is promptly blown away by the swift northern wind. Commander, you're victorious once again! And this time, Gomgata couldn't oppose your strength and was heroically slain. <gasps> the orcs of the Shadow Steel Clan shall henceforth dread your might, Commander. Cunning, they will have to pr they will have to prove to even attempt to find you. But let's not do let's not dawdle a second more. Your goal is within our within your grasp, Commander. Let's set sail again on the ultimate fire to the Tondor. Nice. Uh huh. Ouch. <laughs> yeah, let me go water the plants first. I uh, water the bees. Can't water the bees. Of course you can't water the bees. What the hell, Stella? I I didn't I didn't. I didn't do nothing wrong, all right? It was the she's gosh darn little psycho critters. They just lashed out at me. <laughs> Bunch of lunatics. I'm caring for y'all, all right? You'd be all you'd all be dead if it if I didn't care for you. I should just pump him full of smoke and dump him off the boat, damn bastard. Little little the gosh darn the 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 bees. Shit. Shit. Doing it again, aren't I? It's Dario all over again. 
They're just bees, they can't do anything wrong. And Daria, she's... She's just Daria. No, he's realizing now. I don't know why I get that. I get like that, Stella. Sometimes, sometimes something happens. Any, anything? A big noise? Oh damn! What the hell is this? Oh, oh shit! Oh, anyway, big noise. Someone says something I don't like. Or has got an attitude, or has a bad attitude, and I just, I just get so overwhelmed, overwhelming, get so overwhelming. It feels like I'm drowning, like, and I can't breathe, and I can't think. I just start seeing red, and then I barely remember what happened. What a change, Stella. You gotta believe me, please. Just, I don't know how. If I could do it by myself, but obviously I. Yeah, my chump, I know. Uh, Jackie the Loser, don't think I haven't heard that one before. Can't do anything right, always messing up, just... I... I need some time alone. I can't talk to you right now. No. Oh. No, wait, come back here, I was trying to talk to you! Got anything... On dessert. Right on. Nice. And yeah, no hugs for you. And damn it, Atoll. I have no need of the lightning in the bottles anymore. No. Also, crap. Oh no! Oh no! Then we need more XP bottles. More XP potions. At least there is a way we can just start one without having to deal with the whole. <laughs> Uh, I guess I can go harvest my fruits. Huh. Oh yeah, we also got a cow upgrade, right? A cow stall upgrade? Why does it sound like I hear flapping noises? Get over here. Whee! Oh no! Hello, Alice. Give Alice a hug. Always. Nice. Alright, improve. Hello, cow. Stall. Oh! There we go! Has been improved again. Actually, what the hell does it even improve? Your cows will be less hungry all the time. Nice. Ah, linen. Need a lot of linen. Oh, we got box shipwreck. Nice, y'all come to me. Good job. Good job, little bottles. Also, crap. Oh, we forgot we got this. A nice turnips. One giant onion. And the cabbage. Nice. Uh, turnips. Oh wait, crap, we got three mystery seeds. <gasps> and the bees are ready. The bees are ready. Water as well, just in case. I think basketball games happening nearby. It sounds like air horns and stuff like that. Which tends to always happen in the Philippines. The Philippines love basketball. Though I think they should, you know, go more for football because with their speed and size, they can really go up against uh, top players, maybe. But instead, they play for a sport in which, you know, they're not the tallest. <laughs> oh, yeah. The Filipinos aren't really a tall people. I'm only tall because I'm half. <laughs> I'd have probably been five foot something, but I am six. Six foot flat. <laughs> Except I actually have seen oh, quite a few tall Filipino. Yeah, Filipinos. Well, they're mainly tall because of basketball? Yeah, something like that. Think. 
Uh, fishing time. What can we fish? What can we fish? Alright, let go. We've got a squid. Huh? No, some bay shrimp. Oh, I'm alright with bay shrimp. Of course, I can't eat, can't have it, can't eat it. Obviously, because I'm somehow allergic. So sad. Ooh, what? Squid. So it's a squid, not an octopus. So let's go cook something. Do this. Overbrook patient. Oh, wait, yeah, crap, I remember that one, I think. Strangely requesting for strange things. Hey, cow. Already ready for milking. There, have a cherry. For some reason. <laughs> 36 minutes. Nice. Um. Go do that. Oh, excuse me. Oh. We're close to the place. We're close to the place. Now we need more XP bottles and we need more rose gold sheets. Oh. Right, it should be dawn, but the moon's still there and people are obviously still asleep, so. Woohoo! Nice. We've done it! To the final lighthouse location. It's telling me a light bulb is in that area. Take that, be bright. Is there always been a person there? Hello. I like ads, but I don't like ads. You know what I mean? I think. Oh no. Oh, another person. Own the sheep. You know what? God damn it! You're coming with me. Get shared. Ooh, wait. Is that all the sheep's? Find and shelter all sheep. Oh my god! I got you. Nice. Hey, yeah. Uh, wake up, everyone. Sublime. At last. The world erupts in el elation. All the fires have been lit. Tondor has arisen. The lich god Gor Nemloth is on the verge of being defeated once more. But what is it? What is this terrible ruckus you hear? A thousand war horns roar at once. Could it be? Faithfully, yes. The final assault of the Shadow Steel Clan, led by One Eye, Omgro Omgrathog himself. Clad in the eldritch armor of Rag Rongmar, Umgrathal points his loathsome blade at you. You won't escape me this time, you miserable maggot. I'll destroy you and the hopes of this world. Trembling in fear and apprehension, you gather your inner strength to face the enemy. Make a courage check. 18! Success! Nice. The arc won't scare you, for you are the light bearer, the chosen one. Now the time has come for you to show them. What you are made of, fight! Woohoo! Oh. Hey, nice. Ooh, down here. Nice. Ah, oh, there you are. Nope. Hey. Nice. I haven't seen the purple thing yet. Oh, anyway, there we go. Woohoo! 
Nice. Hey, perfect. Tell me something? Ah. Unimaginable! Through the thick mist of the aftermath, a silhouette is barely discernible against the terrifying backdrop of a gargantuan battle. All, fee all free people of the world are holding their breath, hearts pounding in their chests. A deafening silence creeps in on atmosphere thick as rock. Victory! The chosen one has. The Chosen One has triumphed. She who bears the light has conquered. In a crackling raw sound of terror, Gornemloth's shadow stops immediately its course over the darkened sky. Lich God is no more. May the Radiant Fae bless our, bless our souls. May Halor forever watch over your path. May the grace of Imalda sing our praises of eons to come. The world is saved, and now, jaded but jolly, the hero stands up once more. Looking at her eyes, and her heart fills with hope. Her resolve, uh, stronger than ever. A chapter of her adventures might be completed, but her story is far from over. Rejoice, free people of the world, for the Chosen One will be back. But for now, she will rest her heavy shoulders, unload her burden, and once more gaze at the stars. Hot damn, I'm tired. Congrats! You did it, Stella. Okay, now if you don't mind, I need to take a break. I'll take some time to think about what great adventures we could do next. A space opera with lasers and spaceships? A post-apocalyptic road war setting? Or a horrific eldritch adventure with cosmic horrors, maybe? Alright, so space opera, that's Star Wars. Uh, apocalyptic road setting, that's uh, Mad Max and... Hor horrific eldritch adventure that could be something to do with uh just anything to do with eldritch stuff by uh lovecraft yeah no oh, we'll see nice <laughs> all right let us see what we have cooked hey you eat that goddamn cherry and get sheared i probably do not have the materials needed to build you a home what do we have oh meat stew Meat stew. I mean, hmm, I do love me some meat stew. Hey, hey Stella. We need to talk. We need to have a talk. I'm not doing good, Stella. Like, not at all. I know I act tough and all, but truth be told, I don't think I've ever been doing good. Shit. You know, you really do get on my nerves sometimes. Always so happy, or caring, just sparkly. I don't know how you do it. I've seen those people you care for. I know them because I've cared for them too. And yeah, sure, some of them are nice and all. But most of them, pardon my language, they're assholes. Nitpicky, demanding, rude. But you, everything seems to just glide over you. Damn, need to drink. <laughs> some old cuckoo yells at you because their pudding's the wrong color and you just... You just smile, softly, gently, always. And then you magically fix the situation. You're always the first to arrive, the first to leave. And I've never heard, or the last, did she say, the last to leave? First to arrive, last to leave, I don't know. And I've never heard you bad-mouthing a patient. As for me, I... I need help, Stella. Whenever I try to get better on my own, I just wind up sliding back in a dark place. And I'm so sick of being angry all the time. I think it's time I stop kidding myself. I'm not a caretaker. I can't even take care of myself. So, you know, guess you have a new patient now. I'm sorry to be a burden like that. Not that I know of any other way to live. So, now that the hard things have been said, my room, it's a little bare, don't you think? I want a fresh start, but I'm not sure a naked jail cell is the way to go. 
When I think of something, I'll just ask you straight. No games. For the moment, though, could you get me, like, some posters or something? I can't stand the concrete walls anymore. I already need them covered. I feel like I'm getting cabin fever in there. I'm almost at the... I'm almost at the make a girlfriend out of mashed potatoes point right now. <laughs> Motivation up. Oh, wait, I didn't mean to sit down. <laughs> Alright. We're helping this man. <clears throat> okay, we need clear glass sheet. Alright. As for where we can go, let's see where we can go. Hmm. Look around to see if there are areas where chests have not been opened yet. Alright, we got any chests there. Oh! Sunspring Square? Sunspring Square? Get me over there! There's a chest to be found. And... Damn, what the hell was it? What type of glass? Clear glass sheet. Alright, just clear glass sheet. Woohee! Yay, more honey. Clear glass sheet. Crystal, no, I need clear. Clear, silica powder. Silica powder to the crusher. Silica powder, nice. <laughs> oh crap, this thing's upgraded. Oh my god, we're multiplying. Oh, it's so good! Get everything? Hey, there you go. Whee! Clear glass sheet! Nice. Perfect. Nice, perfect. Was it just a single clear glass sheet? Is that all we needed? Let's go check. Let us go and check. Hey, perfect. Nice, there you go. We're here. Uh -huh. Yeah, I thought it would help, but yeah, it really doesn't. I don't need to hang in there, whatever that means. <laughs> and I certainly shouldn't be proud like a tiger. <laughs> Alright, are tigers even proud? Like at all? Nah, lack of pride certainly not the problem. I just, I'm, I'm selfish, is what it is. I just think of myself, I act rashly, and I wind up hurting people. Hurting a lot of people, actually, and hurting them bad. And then... Then, even if I try to make it better, it's too late. This shit. This shit, Stella. It... It sticks. And when you try to brush it away, you just wind up smearing it. You're just stuck with it, and there's nothing more to it. Old Jackie. Yeah, I don't think I can even get over it. I really thought the posters would help. Turns out they just m make me feel terrible. It might be good. Maybe I deserve to feel terrible. What? No? Don't make that face. I'm serious, you know? Okay, I've got another idea. I think I might need to focus on something else. You know, check out... Check out of Hotel Jackie... Uh, just for a while. I was thinking of a plant. But I'm pretty sure I just kill it. How about uh, something that can't be killed? Maybe like a little sand garden with rocks and stuff. It's kind of like meditation, I guess. Did you get me that? Oh, nice. The Zen Garden. Yeah, could be. Also, we're here. Nice. Let us go. Look for the goddamn chest in this area. I don't even remember this place that much. Woohoo! Alright, nothing completely there. We can enter these places.
Nothing over there. See a tiny person. Oh! Ooh, there you are. It was just a single chest, right? Woohoo! A nice, perfect. We're trying to achieve all chest uh, getting. We pretty much almost got it. Woohee! Now let's head, head over to another place that has missing, incomplete chest picking up things. Lily! Hey, Lily. How are you doing? Good, Lily. Nice. Also, yeah. Damn, we really need a lot more. Oh no, I didn't mean to tap on the morning bell. God damn it. Right, yeah, I've got the stuff there. Check here. Nothing there. Nothing there. Yeah, definitely nothing there. Oh! <gasps> What? I just got a chest there. What the hell was that? A rare chest? It must be inside. Oh, there's still missing stuff there. Single chest there. One definitely there, which I think I know how to get to now. Yeah, let's try that. Alright, for Zen Gardens, what's a Zen Garden like? Steel sheet, silk fabrics. Alright, a single steel sheet and more silk fabrics. Silk fabrics, that's stuff we can do. Nice. <laughs> nice. A. No little thing. A steel sheet. Steel sheet perfect. Yeah. Garden. Neat! Oh, stone garden! I'm kind of surprised, actually. I didn't think you'd go through with it. It's kind of silly, isn't it? Anyway, let's see uh, what we're working with here. The sand is nice. It's got a little. It's got a cool color, and it's very fine, but still has some texture to it. And the stones—they're very pleasant. They've got a nice weight. Very stone-like. <laughs> Even though the wooden rake is all pretty. It's all very soothing. I had a little sand garden in his office. Ooh, we even improved his bed. Just like that, but much smaller. Always wanted to play with it, but he didn't let me. I guess that's the real reason I've asked you for one. Just to get back at him. But you know, he deserved it. The man, hell, he was, um, he was, he was okay. Shit. Doing it again, I'm lying for no goddamn reason. Mom and Pops were okay. They had their issues, sure, but I'm not messed up because of them. No, that one's on me. I don't know why I keep telling these tall tales, like the ones about my grandpa. Truth is, I barely knew him. I saw him once a year, and when I was old enough, he tried to teach me about bees. But I was just a dumb teenager, I didn't care. Then he died. So now I'm a dumb adult who knows jack shit about bees. Guess I want to believe that my childhood messed me up. Otherwise, I have to own up to my own shitty behavior. Yeah, maybe that's just who I am, shitty and broken. 
<sighs> That'd be fitting. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh. Huh. Yeah. Thanks for the garden, Stella. I'll, uh, see ya. No. Oh. He is sad. We're now learning more about Jackie. And the reason why he is... Nope. There we go. Keep on going. 55 minute mark on the whole stream video. It is 9.20. Almost time for 9.30, which is the end of the stream. <laughs> oh, I know. Don't do anything there. Yeah. Let's get some more rose gold sheets. Two more rose gold. Nice. Perfect. Two more. So, one and another one after this. Good, good, good. just thinking, just right now, about like, what the hell was my first Assassin's Creed game? Since, you know, I'm not a person who began at the very beginning like everyone else. I saw something like, uh, on YouTube, uh, The Rad Brad, I think, yeah. Me and my brother, we watched like a first, like a first video thing to see what's like, to see maybe if we might like it. And, uh, the specific one that it was, it was Assassin's Creed 4. Black Flag, the pirates, and holy shit, damn, I remember being so obsessed with it, so damn awesome. We, me and my brother, we got it for the Xbox 360, then, you know, me being me, I loved history and I loved the whole alternate history kind of stuff, so the idea of the assassins fighting the Templars was really awesome and cool and goddamn, uh, what do you call it? Yeah, I just became massively into more, more massively into history. And yeah, I'm pretty much like um, a guy who knows a lot of history because of Assassin's Creed and video games and other stuff like that. Damn. <laughs> yeah, after that we got like Assassin's Creed 2. First time, uh, no, no, we got Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. That's right. Immediately after that. And yeah, I played it and yeah, I loved it some more. Then I believe we got like the Ezio trilogy, which came with Assassin's Creed 2, Brotherhood, and Revelations. I skipped 2 because, you know, I already played 2 before. Yeah. Then, uh, what else? Rogue came out. And we got it for the Xbox 360 as well because being me and my brother were so stupid, uh, thinking 360. That's larger than 4. So, yeah, we got a 360 instead of a PS4. But holy shit, we were so dumb. Goddamn. Unity also came out the same time as Rogue. And I had to just watch Rad Brad play uh, Unity. <laughs> Damn, Rad Brad's awesome. I love the man. I love the guy. He's cool. I believe the first time I ever watched his videos was with GTA... GTA 5! Yeah, damn. That was nice. Watched and played all the way, binged watched it. Back when we didn't even have a Wi Fi in our home, I just sit out there, uh, hooked on to another person's Wi Fi, like someone's, someone else's home. And yeah, I'd just be there for hours watching YouTube, getting mosquito bites and all that stuff. Because. <laughs> Oh, damn, remembering the past. Yeah, I remember you. Yeah, there's a shrine over here. I believe we now have the ability to reach over with the power of Dash. Yahoo! Yahoo! Oh, Buck! Hey, Buck. Thanks. We'll get those mushrooms for you. For some reason, you like mushrooms. And strawberries. Nice. Yeah! 
Yeah! Hey. Perfect. Hello, you. Leaving what could have been is something harder than leaving what has been. What? Me. Well, this do. Can I, like, hold guitar and do something? Nope. No, I didn't mean that. Okay, huh. I remember the thing with Summer. And they did, like, shrine stuff, so I thought maybe I could do something there. But no, nothing happened. <laughs> hey, Buck. Um, you like old fashioned. So how about acquired taste? Okay, acquired taste is all right. Give yourself a hug. Nice, nice. I was in dire need of spirits. Yeah. Now let's head on back before the stream comes to a close. Ha. <sighs> Probably even just, you know, end the stream once we're back in the boat. Woohoo, we're here. Save and quit. Nice. This'll be where I'm leaving us all off. Thank you all for coming over. Coming over and watching me play some more Spirit Fairy today. Woohoo! Hey, nice. Thank you all for coming. And goodbye for both video and stream. <laughs>